What if the truth was a beast we could tame with the right words or perhaps the right melody? In the magical realm of magics, where the extraordinary is ordinary, Bloom and her companions from the Winx Club face a moral quandary that challenges the very fabric of their beliefs. One ordinary day, as the sun painted golden hues across the sky, Bloom, Stella, Flora, Musa, Tecna, and Aisha receive startling news. Samson the Lion, a figure shrouded in controversy, was not only alive but standing right at their doorstep. Get out right now, Bloom said with a fiery glare, her words as sharp as daggers. But Samson, with a weary sigh, pleaded for a moment to explain. You see, I went to war to provide for my country. I was fighting for my country, he insisted. Yet Bloom was unconvinced. Stop, just stop lying. You neglected your son and you went to war just to gain power. There is no other reason, she accused. The air thickened with tension, only sliced by Musa's unexpected interjection. Let's have a little fun. Come in, Samson the lion. As Samson stepped inside, he faced a barrage of skepticism. Tell us the truth. Did you go to war to take power and come home to your son Ryan like nothing's wrong? Stella asked, her voice a mix of curiosity and disdain. Samson's response was firm yet tinged with sadness. Wrong. I would never take power that isn't mine. Just then, Aslan, another noble lion, stepped in, affirming Samson's honesty. He's telling the truth. Ryan has been brainwashed by Scar and Muhatu also got brainwashed, Aslan revealed. The revelation was shortly followed by a call to arms. Both Samson and Aslan were summoned back to the battlefield. Musa, with a spark of inspiration, suggested they halt them with music. As the first notes of burn filled the air, Samson stumbled, weakened by the emotional weight of the lyrics. Despite this, they pressed on, only to be halted again by Musa's next song, Everything, by M2M, which illustrated the pain of lost trust and love. On the battlefield, a young lioness named Kiara fought valiantly. The Winx observed, awestruck by her prowess. Musa played yet another song, Another Dumb Blonde by Hoku, which seemed to resonate with the ongoing struggle, reflecting themes of misconception and misjudgment. Despite their falls and failures, Samson and Aslan finally made it to the battlefield, their spirits lifted by the music and the presence of Kiara. The Winx back at Alfia celebrated the peace that followed, knowing that sometimes, even in a world brimming with magic, the greatest power lies in understanding and empathy. In the end, Bloom and her friends learned a valuable lesson about the complexities of truth and the dangers of quick judgments. Samson, though marred by accusations, proved his integrity not through battles of strength, but through battles of spirit and truth. And through it all, music, the universal language of emotions, played a pivotal role in bridging hearts and healing old wounds. In magics, as in life, the truth often wears many masks, and understanding comes not from confrontation but from compassion and a willingness to listen.